Roadrunner fans, Brian Rowan here, Executive Director of Athletics. We just finished up our first uh, match of the season and the first, first match of a new era for Roadrunner Wrestling. Hey, uh, Coach Antonelli, welcome aboard officially. Uh, must be great to get your feet wet. Uh, early season start against Temple and, and to get a bunch of wins. Yeah, it was exciting. Kids been in the room for uh, four weeks now and uh, I'm kind of getting tired of staying and beating each other up in there. And they're ready to go and uh, I was very proud and impressed with how they came out today. It really was. You know, it showed a little gut and a little determination in a lot of the matches and overcame some adversity. Uh, I think everybody was impressed with uh, where, where you are so early into your tenure. Okay, so you come out, you have 20 wrestlers, they're all ready to go, they're all in great shape. Uh, and, and then beyond that, you start saying, hey, wait, there's some talented guys that could really make some noise, and they're, in, and they're fit already in the season. That's a good start. Yeah, it is. I mean, we've we got some talent in the program here, there's, especially in the middle of our lineup, I think it's our strength. Um, but even up and down, kids, you know, surprising today with what they did on the mat against all the competition. So uh, I'm impressed how, you know, where we're at. I'm glad where we're at, but we also got a long way to go still. Uh, so it'll be a good experience for us next week at the Stroudsburg Open. You know, kids getting to wrestle some different competition, maybe some stiffer competition, some areas, and see actually where we're at and what we need to work on. Hey, so uh, proud tradition here in the sport. Saw some alumni in the stands. Saw some alumni reach out to us uh, online. Uh, Coach Jimmy Rollins reached out, wished us well. John Garrick's uh, Hall of Famer, it's at Centenary, reached out. Van Lynch was in the stands. Jimmy Rudder's an alumni. Uh, the feeling is starting to come around like there's a uh, people want to tie back in with the program. It's got to be a great feeling. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I can't wait because I think the more people we get back involved in the program, I think it's good for the kids, good for the community, you know, great for the college, you know, and I just think that's that's hopefully, you know, the big goal is just to keep it moving in the right direction, keep looking to bring more kids in into the program, and get see more success and bring more people back. Hey, so so a great start. One of the folks, uh, you know, we want to mention uh, Penn Cook, 41 pounder. Uh, great start for him. Really happy to have him back on the mat. Yeah, he's been a leader in the practice room. I'll tell you what, uh, really proud and impressed with what he's doing in the room. Um, him and Jared Carr are workout partners, and uh, those kids go at it, you know. And their drill sessions are some of the best drill sessions that I've seen, you know, seen all year in there. Um, they're committed, hard working, and it showed out there even in the match today. I mean, Jared went up a weight class, wrestled a kid a lot bigger than him, and really, you know, handled him. Hey, your first match of, the, of, of your career here as the Roadrunner head coach. You've got uh, Tate Merlino in a match, local guy, Pittman High School. He's down 6-0 headed to the third period. Yeah, down 6 nothing. you know, we kind of preached to the kids and I told them, you know, the biggest thing is, as a coach in all my years to us, I said, listen, you, you, you go to the last second, you don't stop. You keep going, keep going, because you never know who's going to break at what time in the match. And, you know, and Tate kept just pushing, kept digging and digging and digging. He can show, I think his condition showed there. Uh, a little bit of imposed his will a little bit on him, you know, and kept working hard and got the nice win for him. And I think that really catapulted the kids to it. He saw a little different demeanor on the bench. The kids got up a little bit and then, you know, Josh going out there and getting taken down right away and then turn around and sticking the kid in the nasty half, you know. The kids, you know, that really got them pumped up. Hey, so great start, Coach. We're really proud of it. Next week we go to East Stroudsburg Open, a great test, one of the early prestigious tournaments. Uh, and then we're at the, the uh, Green, uh, Green, Green Terrier, Terrier Duels, Duels in two weeks. Oh. So it'll be a great start to the season. We're really proud of where we are. Fans, if you want to watch all the action, go to NJCAA TV. We're on the on-demand to watch all the matches from today. And great start, Coach. All right, thank you. Thanks. Thank you.